I'm Mrs Chamberlain, I teach A-level fashion textiles here at Christ the King. The content of the course uh, consists of two main strands, technical principles and also designing and making principles. Technical principles consist of things like uh, smart materials, uh, fibres, fabrics, and designing and making principles, design strategies, marketing, that sort of thing. Um, assessment is based on two exam papers. It's a linear course, um, so you will sit the two papers at the end of year 13. Uh, paper one is a technical principles course. It's a two and a half hour exam. It's worth 120 marks and it's a total of 30% of the A-level. Paper two is based on designing and making principles. It's again a written exam of one and a half hours. It's worth 60 marks and 20% of the A-level, and it consists of questions, uh, section A questions, section B questions. It's a mixture of answer and extended response questions, uh, whereas paper one is just a, a mixture of short answer and extended response questions. There is also um, portfolio work, which is 50% of the exam. Uh, the non-exam assessment is uh, a portfolio of work, um, it's a substantial design and make project. It's worth 100 marks and 50% of the A-level. Um, so that entails uh, working on uh, a practical outcome, experimentation, development, creating ideas, um, modelling, making mock-ups, and then producing a final outcome. Um, why, why should you take fashion and textiles at Christ the King? Um, there's loads of careers that you can go into, probably more than you're aware of, uh, you know, not just the obvious ones like fashion design, uh, there's buying, which is what I did, so I was a, a fashion buyer for quite a number of years, I've worked for suppliers, but I've also worked um, on um, the retail side of things as well, so I have a lot of experience, a lot of knowledge, uh, which I pass on to you, um, I would be teaching you pattern making skills, um, how to work, how to create um, something from scratch, uh, which is something that you usually only do at university standard. Um, I have got a student who, um, you'll see their work on the PowerPoint, who's gone on to university to do fashion. Uh, she's really successful, is working as a freelance designer now, but has also come back here um, and she's doing teacher training. So, um, real success story there.